It was where one of the first chapters of Billings history was written, and now the public gets its chance to weigh in on the future of Colson Park. But will upgrading this historic place be a walk in the park or a rocky road? That question, the topic of discussion tonight. Some groups in Billings have been looking at the possibilities of turning Colson Park into something special. Tonight, the public had its first chance to comment on some of those ideas. Q2's David J was at the presentation and joins us now with some of those ideas. David. Well, Janelle Ress, uh, those working on the planning say, Colson Park is at a unique location with the Yellowstone River and being close to Interstate 90. Tonight's meeting gave the public a chance to see what has been done in other cities and what can be done here. The Parks Department has been working with Big Sky Economic Development, DHM Design, and several other groups. An amphitheater has been one of the ideas. The ideas are just uh, for the 50 acres of Colson Park and do not include the old Corret plant land. The discussion has been about how Colson fits into the Billings Park system, transportation, and ecology. Pretty amazing. I mean, 50 acre park right on the Yellowstone River with the sacrifice cliffs there. I mean, it's a real compelling site. Our hope is to really transform that into kind of a special place that's activated, feels safe, and really provides a, a great asset for the community. Eric Meadows says the plan is to get the draft done this summer and have a completed master plan ready in October. Russ, Janelle? All right, thank you, Dave.